Happy Thursday! It is day 17 here in Thailand. I'm super fired up today. Got another adventure going on today. But before that, got to make a couple phone calls, work a little bit, maybe for about an hour, and then we will get our day started with some adventures. GoPro, check. Osmo, check. Extra spare batteries, check. Camera bag, check. Sunglasses, check. Phone, check. G7X, check. All right, so here's the deal. Today, we're going on another bike tour. We're supposed to go around the whole island in one day, but that first day we went around the island, we only got a chance to go around only half of the island because we found a fishing lake and then we ended up fishing for like four hours. So that's why we couldn't complete the tour of the island. If you haven't seen that video, make sure you watch that video here for that part of the tour of the island. So today, we're gonna finish off the rest of the island. We're gonna finish touring the west side of the island all the way down towards the south. The other day, we went on the east side of the island. Let's take a look at the map. We're in Lanta Yai, which is actually the south part of Koh Lanta. This is Lanta Noi, which is the north part. Most of the stuff is here in the south part. We are staying at Pra A Beach, which is also known as Long Beach. It's the longest beach in this whole island. We're currently right about somewhere around here. The other day, our goal was to go around the whole entire island. But here's what happened. We drove up all the way to Saladan Village, which is a really cool spot. We checked out the elephants here, decided not to go swimming with the elephants. They didn't look too sanitary there. So we decided to drive all the way down to the island to this little fishing lake here. When we got there, we found out that the fishing lake is not actually there. It's actually here. So that was a misprint on this map. So the lake is not there, it's over here. So we end up driving all the way back up to this fishing lake. Now when we got there, we had a lot of fun. We ended up staying there for four hours, which is the reason why we didn't finish going around the whole island. And then we made our way back down, cut across. So then we drive back up over here to go to the cave. And you drive to the middle of the island and there's this tiny little dirt road you go down to go to the cave. Now here's a cave called Khao Mai Kau Cave. When we got there, it was about 5.30 p.m. and found out that it's about a half an hour to get into the cave and then half an hour back out. We decided not to go there because it would get too dark. We didn't want to make a long drive back home during the dark hour. So we went back home all the way up here. So that leaves us with pretty much this whole side of the island that we have not explored. Correction, we actually did drive all the way down on this side and made it all the way to Sangayu Resort. And at the end of that, we found a really cool old wooden pier that was so nice looking. There's a DJ Osmo shot in that video, make sure to watch it. So, today, the goal is we are gonna be leaving here, driving down this way, cutting across, going to the cave, gonna visit the cave, go back up, then drive all the way back down this way and go to the end to the national park, might do some hat hiking, check out the scenery there, and then head back home. So that will conclude our whole entire tour of the whole island. Let's get started. Got these shoes on, they're freaking always hard to put on. I always feel like my toes are crooked. It takes me like a couple minutes to get these things on, but once you got them on, it fits like a glove. Gonna be doing some hiking today. It is super hot. We're wearing these long sleeves, but they're actually breathable, so they actually feel very cool wearing long sleeves, so that way we don't get sunburned. Pink Scoopy! Information. Alright, we are here and we are going to Ka, Ka Mai Kao Cave, also known as the Diamond Cave. There's a little hike that we have to go through. We got our little trusted guide right here with the headlamps. 
about to go in. Here we go. We just made two new German friends. <laughs> What's your names? Eric. Eric, nice to meet you. Hi. Eric, this is Eric, and your Hi. name? Aline. Aline, nice to meet you. Where in Germany are you guys from? Uh, I'm from Berlin. She's from Dresden, and we live in Stuttgart. Berlin and Tristan. <laughs> All the way from Germany to Thailand. We are officially hiking. <laughs> Woo, here we go. More going up. No problem. Holding this camera and going up is very easy. Very easy. One-handed. Snake? We might find some snakes. Next question, some snake is poison. Oh, okay. King Cobra or Python King Cobras and Pythons. No big deal. No big deal, you know? Yeah, no big deal. Yeah. Look at her face. Huh? What happened? You like snakes? Yeah. No. No, you don't like snakes? Really? There's one right there! <laughs> Alright, watching out for snakes. Climbing up this wooden ladder. Woo. This is a little sketchy. Just held up by rusted nails, no problem. <laughs> no problem. It shouldn't break. It shouldn't break. Very safe. Good choice bringing the camera today, David. Alright. And we made it. And there's more rocks to climb up. Jeez. Oh, Vlogging in the middle of the jungle. Watching our steps because we don't want to step on any king cobras. Check out this gnarly tree with spikes. Holy cow. Woo. Those look really sharp. Gotta watch your head for that. All right, how you guys doing? Good? All right. No stepping on snakes. No stepping on snakes. No stepping on snakes. For the record, the men are in the back. The women are in the front. So they can get bit by the snake first. That's the cave we're going to. About 150 meters. But the entrance is all the way up there. Man, it's really beautiful in here. Check out this tree. What? Okay, just a little winded. <laughs> we hiked up about 500 feet of rocks and we made it to this grand, huge entrance in front of the cave. I mean, I've never seen a cave this big before. Look at this. It's so huge. Uh, this cave opened up about 45 years ago. That's a really small, narrow entrance. It looks so sketchy, but hey, you only live once. We got to strap on these headlamps because it's pitch black in there. All right, all right here we go. There's lilies. I gotta put mine on. We are going in. Don't recommend this for little kids for sure. Hopefully I, this camera comes back out alive and hopefully we come out out here alive. Whoa. If you're claustrophobic, whoa, this rock just moved on me. <laughs> if you're claustrophobic, I do, I do not recommend you doing this for sure. Air condition. Is yeah. Fine. It's very cool in here surprisingly, so it actually feels very good. So. The temperature in here is really nice. Found a little cave frog. It is completely pitch black in here. <laughs> oh, there's, yeah, it's a little scary in here, but no big deal. No big deal. We're making our way down, going deeper and deeper into the hole. The hole of mystery. David Vu, the adventurer. Da, 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 da. <laughs> so I forgot what the difference is with a stalagmite and a stalactite. I don't even know if I'm saying it right, but one forms from the top and the other forms from the bottom. Shiny. Yep, pretty cool. Very shiny, glittery. It's like sugar. Ooh. I like it. Hello. <laughs> hey, how come there's no echo? There's a little opening here, so that's why there's no echo. Whoa, spider! A spider! Stay away from that guy. That guy looks freaking mean. Look at that sh dang. Holy crap, that's a bridge. Alright, no big deal. Uh, 
bamboo bridge. Actually, I learned that bamboo is one of the strongest woods, the most flexible in the world. Dude, this is some big spider. Here's a zoom in shot for you guys. If you like spiders, give me some likes and a thumbs up. <laughs> Comment below. Look at that guy. I thought he's huge. It's like the size of my hand. Yeah, no big deal. Bamboo bridge. Bamboo bridge with five people on it. Lily's saying I'm too fat now. <laughs> oh my god, it's hard for me. Okay. Big old chubby American coming through. Oh, the little tight squeeze. Oh, oh man, my butt's too big. <laughs> Made it. Nailed it. Whoa. That is pretty cool. Echo! Hello! Hello! <laughs> That's cool. Man, it is. This is a cool experience. What is down there? Look at this. I feel like I'm about to watch it. I feel like I'm making a scary movie. Dun 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 Oh my gosh, we are lost right now. We don't know which way to go. Do we go that way? Do we go that way? Or do we go that way? Or do we go that way? Okay, good thing we have a guide. <laughs> Yay, we made it to the last room. Holding a camera while going down a wooden ladder inside a cave. It's probably the smartest thing I've ever done. One step at a time. Yay, Lily, you made it. Whoa, I heard a crack. That wasn't good. <laughs> we are now in the bat cave. Look at how cool they are. Check out all these little bats. Let's go see if we can take a closer look. That's so cool. Just chilling there, just hanging out. Hanging out. Bye bye, bats. Bye. -bye. Oh, that was probably the coolest cave trekking trail I've ever done. All right, quick update we just got out of the cave. I uh, couldn't have filmed the last 15 minutes besides the bats. That was super intense. We went through these crevices and nooks that were like literally, I barely could fit through them. I had to suck in my gut. My little chubby butt <laughs> had a hard time. We were literally on our stomachs, like crawling through and our backs just sliding through the cave. It was pretty freaking nuts. I'm sweating like crazy, I'm all dirty. Uh, gonna hike back now and look for a nice beach and jump in the water. All right, just left the cave. Actually, we got out of the cave a few hours ago and we made two German friends and we we're just hanging out with them, sipping coconuts. Now we are headed to the south part of the island and going to the beach and go swimming. Check out the aftermath and how dirty we got. We got dirt everywhere because we we're crawling through all these spaces. There it is. <laughs> Am I dirty back there? Mm-hmm. Time to go swimming. Bye guys, see you tomorrow. Bye. Well, I just found where all the people in Thailand fish on this island. I have no idea where we are, but I will remember this spot. Must be a lot of fish here. One, two, three, four guys fishing. All right, we got a little hungry on our drive, and on our way here, we saw this little cool restaurant called Diamond Cliff Restaurant. So, I'm gonna go check out the scene here.
My favorite food. Everything on the menu. Oh wow. Where should we sit? Man, this place is so nice. Seriously, one of the best seafood restaurants we have been to since we've been here in Thailand. Glass noodles with seafood, seafood, and soft shell crab curry. Chicken soup. Really good. And heart shaped rice. That's Yummy. Good. Yay, we made it! We have officially been on every single road and every single part of the island. This is the furthest southwest point of the island. And behind us is the national park. It's closed right now, so we're definitely gonna explore that another day. But uh, this is an amazing view. Check it out. Got the sunset over there. We're probably gonna go to a beach that's down there somewhere. It's the last beach um, before the road ends. So we did it. We've gone around the whole island. That officially means David and Lily conquered Koh Lanta. We've gone everywhere. We know every nook, every cranny. Yeah. <laughs> We're Koh Lanta experts now. So we found this little beach. We don't even know the name of the beach, but we saw a bunch of bikes parked here. And this is the last beach before the road ends. So we're going to go check it out. Nice. Look at that beautiful view. This view is ridiculous. Look at this sunset right here. Another amazing and fun adventurous day is coming to an end and we feel so blessed to be here uh, in Thailand right now. Just enjoying the scenery, enjoying the view and it's just so peaceful and amazing here. So with that, gonna enjoy the rest of the night, watch the sunset, do some swimming, maybe get a massage, I don't know. But this vlog is over.